What's going on, everybody? My name is Chris the Chaos Gamer, and welcome back to Pokemon Snakewood. In the last episode, in the last episode, we um, we got two new team two new team members, uh, as you can see from the layout, and. Hopefully in today's episode, we're going to get ourselves to Meteor Falls, the base of operations for the Four Horsemen. So if you guys are excited for today's episode, be sure to click that thumbs up button like you never clicked it before and subscribe to the channel for more videos. And be sure also to click that little bell icon right next to the subscribe button so that then you too uh, will get emails or uh, mobile notifications whenever I upload a video so because we all know how YouTube subscriptions are like so let's do a quick team recap shall we first we have our newly evolved Poic the Claydol thank god I've been waiting for this I've been waiting for this guy to evolve for so long and now we finally have it Poic, the Claydol, level 36, Rocket, Psybeam, Harden, and we taught it Hyper Beam instead of um, Rapid Spin. Because I noticed that no one really used any uh, entry hazards, so I figured Hyper Beam would have been, would be good to keep, at least for now. Uh, next up is Maya Argyrodos, level 36, holding the Gamble Fish with Twister, Tackle, Bite, and Surf. Next is our new 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 quillfish level 29 holding the brain link because apparently i found out that he evolves at level 33 so i'm just like i don't know anything about this evolved mon i don't want to know anything until he gets level 33 so i'm excited to find out what that is all about he has minimized headbutt water gun and pin missile next is gary our slugma level 35 holding the demon horn with yon ember rockrow and harden we have Sapuku, our Nuzleaf, level 36, holding the leftovers with Bide, Faint Attack, Cut, and Fake Out. And we have Terry, our Aerodactyl, level 40, not holding anything, but he has Bite, Supersonic, Ancient Power, and Scary Face. Alright, so that is our team for now. Puffy, before we move on, I should have done this before, but I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to give Toxic... Actually, no. He has poison points, so what's really the point? <sniffs> Jokes. Uh, <laughs> um, I don't think there. Can anyone learn Shockwave? You know, that might not be all that bad. At least then he has, like, you know. I know it's not stab, but I mean. <sighs> It never misses, so I believe it's like a 60 power. Uh, I'll think about that later. In the meantime, we have to get ourselves up to Meteor... Ooh! Magic Stars? I knew that was, like there was an item there before. Magic Stars. Raises special defense. You know who really needs special defense? Poic. <laughs> All right, let's get ourselves. What Pokemon is in this road anyway? Zangoose. Now we did find out a couple episodes ago that Zangoose did have a um, did have an evolution. I'm not sure if that was in like an evolution. There's got to be something here. Okay, I guess not. All right. So hopefully we're gonna get into Meteor Falls and hopefully get some story done. Is there any trainers up this way? Oh, are you serious? <sighs> Can anyone learn Rock Smash? I don't really want to, but it looks like I might have, might have to go back and get, yeah, alright. I don't want any of these guys to learn Rock Smash. Um, actually, before I do, before I do, what is... Rock Smash. Rock Smash. It has. It's. It was. Yeah, it's a 20 power fighting type move. It got up to. 
it got up to 40 in Gen 4. So I'm going to go back and I'm going to get the... Um, I'm going to go back, I'm going to get my Zigzagoon. Which means someone has to leave the party for a little, for a nice little bit. Ah, shoot. So, yeah, someone's gotta leave the party for a little bit. I don't know who. Um... Good thing it wasn't really all that far, to be honest. Alright. I don't want to... I don't want to switch anyone out right now. You know what? Just temporarily, I'm going to move Terry out of the box. Because he doesn't really have all that good moves anyway, at least right now. And I th we've been doing fairly good, so... <laughs> good question mark. Uh, <laughs> so... We got ourselves... I think that's what we'll do. C dot. We already have a C dot. All we need to know. Uh, it was a leaf. Yeah. In order for us to get Sapuku to evolve, we have to get a leaf stone. Which a leaf stone is on our way to Four Tree, which is our next area after Meteor Falls. So. Okay, Alicia's there. Right on the bottom le right hand left hand corner of the screen. Alright. Rock appears to be breakable. I don't I I feel bad for leaving Aerodactyl behind. Hoenn National Trust Info Board. Meteor Falls. Meteor Falls has neither meteors nor falls. Discuss. Yeah, okay. So Alicia is apparently on our side now. If you haven't watched yesterday, if you haven't watched the other, if you haven't watched the previous episode, all right, let's talk to her. I don't remember the voice I gave her. Come on, we got to stop the four horsemen for our lord and for your revenge. Okay. All right. Um, there's gonna be a lot of battles going on. I think I gave Puffy the Brain Link, yes. I kind of want to keep Poic in the lead. Um, because his defenses are good. He has Levitate. Um, only thing is his special attack is really bad. He doesn't really... Or I could just start off with Maya. Let's start off with Maya. Because Maya has been doing excellent. Bite's been getting flinches when we needed it. Come on, Chris, we need to do we need to go. And a whole bunch of zombies. Let's run past the footmen will take care of them. Okay. I'll see you on the lower floor. That's where the horsemen will be. On the lower floor. So are you telling me I can't go this way? Oh, there's an item. Oh, there's an item there I can grab. What's this? TM23. All right, what's TM23? Iron Slam. Can anyone know it? Puffy can know it. And okay. Um, I don't think I want to give that to Puffy. Ugh, strength. I don't have strength. All right. Famine! Pestilence! Pestilence! This battle ends here. Alicia, help me bring them down. Yeah. Knew it! Knew it. Can't trust her. They're all laughing. What's so funny? Watch who you call Alicia, brat. Alicia? I am no- I am no more Alicia than you. There was never any Alicia. I am war. Another horseman. Yeah. Everything was a lie. Everything I told you from the moment I met you in Old Dale. We created the character of Alicia, lied about your past in order to lure you here. The leader of the forces in the East wanted you. 
So we stopped him. We faked your death. We we faked your death. But before we could recover your body, you woke up and went with the damnable birch. So I disguised myself as a human. Slowly, I gained your trust, and now you are here and you cannot escape. I don't even remember the voice I gave Famine. Or Pestilus. Could not... Told you Hulu could not be a horseman. My little sister told you in Verdant Turf uh, that she was the sole female member of the four horsemen, for example. All lies. Who am I? Why does this Dark Lord of the East want me? We don't know. It is Meteor's duty to find out. His daughter was punished heavily for his betraying to Duford. That bit is true. Meteor's daughter is locked up. Of course, how else How else would you control a dragon? They're far too temperamental and hot-blooded to be controlled without such brutish methods. So I'm a victim. Meteor's a victim. I guess there's only one person I can trust around here. I don't need your help, Alicia, or war, whatever you call yourself. I'll send all you demons back to hell where you belong. I'll end the zombie war, find my brother, I'll free Meteor's daughter, and restore home into all its former glory. I'm 16. <coughs> Whatever the point is, you don't stand a chance. Meteor didn't, Chloe didn't, nor your brother. I'm serious. I'm defeated. I defeated foes Chloe couldn't. I'm stronger than her. I defeated your corrupted Aerodactyl, Famine, when my brother, uh, when my brother couldn't. I'm stronger than him. I defeated Meteor. I'm stronger than him. Do you understand? I'm the strongest in Hoenn. Chloe told me so, and I can see it's true. And I just keep hitting my microphone. Perhaps, but we are the strongest in the universe. If you think you can take us on, I shall be your first opponent. I won't hold back. I intend to kill you. Looks like we have triple battle. Or not triple battle, but like three battles straight straight. Horseman War 6. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> Level 39. Um... I could go bite. I'm pro I'm more than likely faster than that Sableye. I could go bite. Something's telling. You know what? Let's go Twister. Because Twister has a twi chance of has a chance of flinch. Shadow Swipe. Can I serve? How much does serve? We will never know. Not this turn. We won't. How much does surf do? You hit two protects in a row. Come on. Can I, you know, like, actually hit? Thank you. Surf does a nice, nice chunk of change. You have leftovers. Or no, Citrus Berry. That's fine. Alright, I might heal Maya up this turn. Because more than likely, he's probably going to, um... I have a feeling he's probably going to protect, so I'm going to heal. Nope, there's a Shadow Swipe. Okay. You read me there. Surf. Can I get a crit? May I? Can you crit? Ooh, not quite. Come on. Alright, I'm going to Super Potion again, thinking he might use Protect. There's a Shadow Swipe. I know I'm faster. Tackle won't do anything because these part goes. I might as well hit Twister. Alright. May I should get a nice, nice juicy level up from this. Yeah! Level 37, here we go. Ban it. I'm gonna leave Maya in. Does Bite. Bite should. Okay. His Bennett is faster. That's fine. Ooh! Ooh! Maya, 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 Maya. Oh, Maya or Mio Moyo. Please don't use Shadow Swipe again. Maya? Oh, of course you get a crit. Okay. Um. Heart goes, so Pollock won't definitely. I could Sapuku. Actually, you know what? Let's send Sapuku out. 
because we can get a good juicy fake oh wait no he's part ghost he's ghost why did i forget that why did i forget that Bennett was ghost when i hit fake out <sighs> i'm an idiot all right gary i could no yan won't work because it's normal the fact that you're just spamming Shadow Swipe pisses me off. Alright. Alright, Puffy. Your turn. You're definitely going to be slower. Pin Missile? Oh my god. I'm getting floored. Alright, Pollock. That Shadow Swipe is definitely going to hurt. Ancient power. I'm faster? Um, okay. I never would have thought that public would have been faster than a Benet. Alright, so we're... We're done. We're dead here. So... Cry job. Um... We're at 16 minutes. I know what mons you have now. It's a shame that fairies aren't in this game because Sableye, uh, oh my God. Okay. Uh, I guess we're fighting you. Slugma, send out Maya. Okay, so I might need to uh, do a little bit of training off screen. Whether I'll record it, I don't know, because I gotta do quite a bit. I think because of the amount of training I gotta do, because I gotta get everyone, I say at least level 30, uh, 45. However, what I will do is um, when it comes to evolving Quillfish, because we know he evolves at level 33. We know that much. There's a Swablu here. Interesting. Um, yeah, so I gotta get basically everyone relatively up to level 45. That's gonna take a while. I don't think I'm going to do that. I don't think I'm gonna record that. What I'm definitely gonna do, though, is show... Um, at the beginning of next episode, what I will do is when Quillfish is close to leveling... Um, or close to evolution, I'll probably have that as a, probably a beginning video, like, beginning portion to the video. I'll decide that when the time comes. So, I'm gonna end things off here. I know it's slightly shorter than usual, and I apologize, but we're underleveled. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. We're underleveled, and I need to do some training. So... If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to click that thumbs up button like you never clicked it before, and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this one. I've been Chris the Chaos Gamer, and I will see you in the next video.